We're here on the edge of Lauka National Park in the Altiplano, on the Chilean side uh, of the Altiplano near Bolivia and Peru. And we've seen cows and we've seen alpacas, but what I really want to see is some llamas and some of the endangered vicuñas. Fingers crossed. So we didn't see any llamas or vicuñas on that trip. It seems to be around Putra is more an agricultural space. Our trek has been halted by a herd of animals that are on their way up. So we're just hanging out here for a while while they pass. So it's a day later and we're a thousand meters higher. We're almost 4,500. But yesterday we were 3,500 in Putra. And finally we see some vicuñas in Nauka National Park. Vicuñas are the rarest and shyest of South America's camelid species. In the 1960s, they were close to becoming extinct because they were slaughtered for their wool, which is even finer than alpaca. But vicuñas are a conservation success story. Andean countries signed a conservation agreement, and in the 1980s, populations began to recover. Local Andean communities began managing the species sustainably, and now vicuña are shorn and then released back into the wild. Without their valuable wool, they're of no use to poachers. And with communities profiting from the sale of the wool, people are motivated to protect them. Today, vicuñas are no longer endangered, though they're still very wary of humans. Our vicuña spotting mission was complete. We also came across some viscacha among the rocks, which are a species of the chinchilla family. Then, finally, we found some llamas. Although, some were more wild than others. <laughs> you might eat my camera. <laughs> ah, she's dropping in the car. <laughs> okay, we're gonna go now. Do you want to step away from the car? We don't want to run you over. Do we go? <laughs> <laughs> bye. Uh -oh. No more. Bye bye. Ciao ciao. Mucho gusto. <laughs> Bye! Bye! Bye-bye! <laughs> Bye! I miss you!